Thank God for his grace and mercy. By his grace and mercy, we are allowed in his holy sanctuary. To God be the glory. It's prayer time, church. If you just keep that track going right there, minstrels, that melody right there sets the moment. To consult the throne of grace. Let us all invest ourselves in oneness right now. The oneness of the spirit, the oneness of God's glory. In the spirit of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. sanctuary God's sanctuary in the presence of God there's no better place than in the presence of God in the oneness of the spirit in the bond of peace in Jesus Christ what a mighty God we serve church is prayer time now let us prepare our hearts to seek the throne of grace. And I know that every one of us that <clears throat> has been led here by the Spirit of God, God has deposited something or someone on your heart to pray for today. So let us all stand, those that can stand. Those that can't, we do understand. And if you will, at this time, will you call out their names? Amen. 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 Call them out. Amen. Call them out. Amen. Yes, God hears you. He hears every word. Call him out. Amen. We want to send prayer out for those who are on our prayer list. Sister Kathy Mack. Sister Kathy Howerton. Sister Retha Daniels, Sister Gwen Smalls, Reverend George Counts and Sister Cora Counts, Sister Sadie Morgan, who's with us today, Sister Yvonne Simpkins, Sister Lucinda Parks Kenner, Sister Ollie Anderson, Brother Chris and Sister Joyce Bailey, Sister Rosa Harris, Little Master John Paul Casanall Jr., Little Master Messiah Stokes, Brother Jeffrey Smalls, Sister Pearl Davis is with us today, Sister Betty Wright, Brother Thomas Johnson. We want to send prayer out for those at a time of bereavement, trying to understand God's perfect love in a time of grief. The scripture tells us in 2 Corinthians, the seventh chapter, the 10th verse, for God the grief produces a repentance that leads to salvation without regret. Wherefore, worldly grief produces death. As we grieve, church, let us grieve into the, the blessings of God. Let us grieve being mindful of the death of Jesus Christ and knowing that God's plan is a perfect plan of salvation. And earth has no sorrow that heaven cannot heal, for God is above all, over all, and is in charge of all so we thank God we want to send prayer out for those who who feel like they can't find their way we want to send prayer out for the homeless those that we perhaps sometimes pass each day and sort of not think about them a second time but let us lift them up in prayer and continue to urge the support of so many who have not and God has blessed us with so much. Let us prepare our hearts as bow our heads as we seek God's throne. 
our Heavenly Father, our Creator, our Sustainer. Oh God, you are our Keeper. You are our Waymaker, oh God. And Lord, you have set the path of our lives forward. And Father, not only did you set the path of our lives forward, you gave us a way maker, O oh God, to make that path doable, that we could overcome the barriers, the pitfalls, the potholes, and the ditches that may stand in our way. God, you are a God that consoles us, for you are a great consolator. When our hearts are heavy and our minds are burdened, oh God, when tears start to roll, you, you wipe all of our tears away. And oh God, none of us here today are not without your grace, your mercy, your love, and forgiveness. So God, we thank you this day. We bless you this day. As we stand in the oneness of the Spirit and in this holy house right now, God, we feel your Spirit hovering over us, O oh God. And Lord, we ask that you have your way. Lord, if there's anybody right now, Lord, that's feeling burdened, Lord, will you lift that burden? If anybody right now, God, is feeling out of place, Lord, will you hold them and remind them that you love them? And that we are all a part of your kingdom, oh God. Oh Father, we ask that you, if there's anyone who's confused, Lord, that you will show them the way. Anybody's tired, oh God, will you give them strength, oh God? Anybody weary, Lord, will you uh, re restore them right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, if there's anyone holding on to something and they can't quite let go. Lord, will you release that yoke, Lord? We, we, will you break that chain, Lord? Because your word says he'll remove the shackles from your neck. So God, we thank you this day. We thank you. We thank you. We bless you, O oh Lord. We ask God that you touch every gift and talent. And God, bring us to a place of realizing just what we are celebrating today. Just what we are observing today. Remind us, Lord, of the significance of the oneness of the body. Not to fail to discern the oneness of your body, Lord, in all that you give us to do. Remind us, Lord, that your words say that we should love each other. We should trust each other and do all things decently and in order, Father. And Lord, we know that you give gifts to us, Lord. You give us talents, O oh Lord. Embellish those gifts right now, Lord. Uh, embellish those talents right now, Lord. Uh, remove any impediments, any barriers, O oh God. Uh, and bring this church to the fullness of your glory, O oh God. Uh, God, move anything that's in the way. Uh, remove any selfishness that may be blocking unity, O oh God. Uh, remove any doubt that may be stroking fear, O oh God. Uh, build us up right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Uh, God, we know you have a plan and we know that plan is moving right now but Lord count us worthy by your power God to stand in that gap to stand in the gap Lord of a belief and non-belief Lord that we never fail our first love God that we are to go out into the harvest for the harvesters the harvest is plenty but the harvesters are few. Lord, we reject Satan who confuses, who adds burdens to misery, to, to, who adds lostness to confusion. But God, we know when we look up to the hills, all of our help all of our help, God. All of our help comes from you. As David said, Lord, you will make our feet like hinds feet in high places. Lord, back us up to that mountain and plant our feet, Lord, and give us 
a broad step in space. God, we, we want your power. We need your power, God. We feel your power. And Lord, we look to the promises and the blessings. For you loved us so much, you sent your only son, Jesus to die for the remission of our sins. And God, as we gather here today, as we sit together, God, remind us as we partake of this Holy Supper, what is your purpose? And Lord, in that, that your will shall be done. Heal the sick, recover the lost, give sight to the blind. Oh God, we ask you now in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 To God be the glory. All the things that he has done.